and uh, check out is at noon. Uh, thank you for staying in the Delaware Pines. If you need anything else, my name is Miles. Okay. Oh, uh, now that you mention it, uh, are there any good places to eat around here? Good places to eat. Nope, I'm afraid not. Sorry. <laughs> really? You, you can't recommend a single place? Good places? No. I, I don't eat at good places, ever. <laughs> that's unfortunate. Hey, that's life in Delaware. Anything else I can uh, focus out with? Um, oh, yeah, you know what? Ooh, we're so silly. We left our cell phone chargers back at the last hotel. Is there maybe like a Best Buy around here? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you just head out. When you leave the parking lot, you make a right. You go for a bit till you hit the 50. And you drive for about four hours till you leave Delaware and you hit Maryland. They got them there. <laughs> you, don't, you don't have one in this state? Uh, we were going to get one, but those Best Buy fat cats didn't want to put a location in a quote-unquote desolate hellscape. So. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, don't be. They're Maryland's problem now. <laughs> Filthy crab eaters, what with their vibrant cities, fulfilling jobs, and low suicide rate. Anyway, no Best Buy. <laughs> uh, do you maybe have a convenience store? Oh, like a 7-Eleven? Yes, yeah. No, no. Uh, we do got Billigan's Bait and Tackle. But they mostly, oh, well, all they got is bait and tackle. You folks look at a fish, uh, soak some worms, throw some lines? Maybe. Because uh, I wouldn't. Fish here ain't much to look at. They're all dead. Oh, that would explain the smell. Yeah, most of it. Fish went belly up when they built the tannery out on the Nanakote. Oh, a tannery? Honey, did you hear that? I've always wanted to take a tour of a tannery. Well, you could if you had a time machine. The uh, tannery went uh, out of business in 2004. Put 200 good tannery workers uh, out of a job. Oh, God, that's terrible. Yeah, uh, you know, what's really terrible is 200 tannery workers checking into your hotel for the express purpose of killing themselves. <laughs> that, that really is terrible. Yeah, worst part, that was our best weekend all year. I took a trip to Dover on that money. But enough about me, folks. What are you doing in town? You uh, looking to do some illegal dumping, uh, dodge some taxes, punch dogs without consequence? No, what? No. You could do it. It's all right. You just got to tell me. No consequence. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're, we're, we're actually, we're here for the expo. Oh, hot dog, the Mid-Atlantic Chocolate Expo. Bummer. That's the stuff Hershey can't legally bring to market. I went one year, I got into a fight with a guy in a Mr. Goodbar costume. He bit me, and now I have cholera. <laughs> Seriously, what the flip? Yeah, me and my mistress here have been planning this trip for weeks. <laughs> oh. We're ruining our vacation! Oh, is that so, huh? You'd rather me spin you some cock and bull story about how great everything is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah well, you know what? That optimism might fly in Maryland, but this <laughs> is Delaware, and we got a saying here. Everything stinks, and if you don't like it, you head back to Baltimore or Trenton or whatever paradise you hail from. <laughs> and you leave us here with our fishless rivers, our empty factories, and our 97% missing persons rate. <laughs> Delaware, where the American dream is laid to rest. Oh. Listen, Miles, we're sorry, yeah, okay? I... Yeah, we, we didn't mean to insult you, or, or oh, Delaware. Oh it's all right, it's fine. I just uh, I get a look, a little worked up. I'm going to talk about the first state. Sure. Real passionate. Hey, I like you guys. What do you say I upgrade you to the honeymoon suite? King size bed and all. That would be great. I just gotta wait for the current occupant to check out. Okay. And it's all yours, folks. <laughs> <laughs>